This is the Unitarian Church of Lincoln's daily video update for Thursday, August 13th, 2020. I'm the Reverend Oscar Sinclair. In 2017, the Unitarian Universalist Church of the Restoration in Philadelphia adopted an eighth principle written by Paula Call Jones and Bruce Pollock Johnson and recommended that the whole UUA adopt it. That eighth principle reads, we, the member congregations of the Unitarian Universalist Association, covenant to affirm and promote, journeying towards spiritual wholeness by working to build a diverse, multicultural, beloved community by our actions that accountably dismantle racism and other oppressions in ourselves and in our institutions. The eighth principle is a challenge. In some ways, it in considering the eighth principle, it is in considering the eighth principle that the wider conversation about what our pr principles call us to has come about. Because the seven principles are aspirational. They describe values that we hold and point to a world of justice, equity, and truth. And the question, with any series of aspirational statements, is this. Why aren't we there yet? What is it that keeps the world as it is, instead of how it ought to be? Reverend Tom Shade puts it this way, the seven principles as written do not describe what opposes them. They are sunny and utopian. Their shallow, shadow side, though, is our self-righteousness, which follows directly from the principle's one-sidedness. They do not name that they are not universally practiced and why we ourselves fail them so often. After all, if we have such high ideals, then we must be the good ones. And those who don't agree must, therefore, be the bad ones. The Eighth Principle explicitly names racism and other oppression in ourselves and in our institutions as a barrier to spiritual wholeness and the beloved community. It addresses a hole in our theology and centers the work of dismantling racism and building the beloved community in our congregations. Tomorrow, we'll talk about what the process looks like going forward. The UUA has named a task force to look into broad revisions of the principles, and over the next year and a half, we're going to start digging into that together. <laughs>